ISRO's second rocket was the ASOLV, or Augmented Satellite Launch Vehicle. The ASOLV was developed as an improved version of the SOLV Satellite Launch Vehicles by the Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO. The ASOLV had a distinctive appearance with four strap-on booster rockets attached to its core stage. These boosters were known as SITVEX, strap-on integrated technology vehicle clusters, and were used to witness rockets thrust during liftoff. The core stage of the ALV was similar to the SOLV, using a combination of solid and liquid propellants. The first stage of the ALV consisted of the S solid rocket motor, which provided the initial thrust during liftoff. After the first stage burnout, the Sitviks were jettisoned, and the second stage, powered by Vika's liquid engines, took over to continue propelling the rocket towards its intended orbit. The third stage of the ALV was a liquid-fueled propulsion stage called the L into the desired orbit. The ASOLV paid off capacity to lower 2 kilograms. The maiden flight of the ASOLV took place on March, from the Sriharikota range, now Satish Dawn Space Center in India. And the rocket successfully placed the kilogram SROS C satellite into orbit, marking a significant milestone for ISRO. The ASOLV program underwent several modifications of the ASOLV faced challenges and encountered technical issues. The ALF program underwent several modifications and improve find their insights and experience to engineers, helping them engineers, brilliant e-technology. The knowledge gained from the ASOLV program played a crucial role in the subsequent development of more advanced launch vehicles like the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle, SOLV and the Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle, SOLV today, ISRO continues to make strides in space exploration and satellite launches with its highly capable SOLV and SOLV rockets, and the ASOLV's contributions have been instrumental in India's journey towards becoming a major player in the global space arena.